Welcome back, maniacs. My apologies, we're a couple days late on the video this week. That's okay. Uh, we're going to waste about five to six minutes of your day, show you how to add gifts to your stream, either via Channel Point Redemption or Command. I don't f***ing care which one you use. I'm going to show you how to do both of them. Without further ado, sit back, shut up, and follow the f***ing clicks. All right, so the first thing we need to do is head over to OBS. Uh, go to whichever scene we're going to be doing our Redeem in. All we need to do is add a single source, and it's going to be a browser source. I'm going to call my browser source GIF Redeem, because it makes sense to my small brain. Uh, URL, all this we can leave blank. And then you can position it wherever you want it to pop up on the screen. For the sake of this, I'm just going to kind of center it up. Boom, right in the middle of the screen. That's all we have to do in OBS. Then we're going to... If we want to add sound, um, use something like my instance and find a sound clip. Go. Here's a sound clip I want to use. I'm going to download the MP3. Got it. And then I'm going to go to Giphy. Looking for Git Rex. Find the GIF that you want to use and click on it. And we're just going to minimize that for a minute while we set up StreamerBot. Once we get to StreamerBot, let's make a new action. I'm going to call it Git Wrecked. I'm going to put it in a group called GIF Redeems because I'm assuming you're going to want multiple redeems. I'm going to put it in its own nice little group. Sub actions are nice and simple. First thing we're gonna do is go to core, sound, and play sound. We're gonna get the sound that we downloaded earlier, which is gonna be for me right in the downloads folder. I would move this to a different folder, um, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna keep it. Then uncheck this box, finish playing before continuing, and press okay. The next thing we're gonna do is OBS, source and set browser source URL. Make sure it's on the correct scene and source. Now we're going to head back over to the GIF that we wanted, click on the embed button and copy the code. Once we get it copied, we'll go back to StreamerBot, paste it, but we're not done. We need to go into the URL box. Everything that is to the left of this quotation mark gets deleted and then we need to find the end of the link here annotated by another quotation mark and delete everything to the right of that. Now we're left with just a regular old URL. Um, you can make sure it works by copying it, putting it back in your web browser and now it shows up as just the URL or I'm sorry just the GIF. So we press OK. Now that we've set it we want to show it. So OBS, source, set visibility state, and we want this to be the GIF redeem to visible. I usually do a delay of about three and a half seconds. Obviously you can adjust this if you got longer redeems, um, that's on you. And then we need one more to hide the visibility. GIF redeem and hidden, press OK. Going to OBS real quick here and make sure that we hide this so that our action is going to pop up properly when we test it. Um, now we got two main ways we can trigger this. We can set it up for a command. Um, if you don't want to use channel point redeem, then obviously just core command and command triggered. Create a new call command. I'm going to call it rect. Rect. So I'm going to uncheck these because I always use the built in. Um, feature streamer bot chat and press OK. Obviously, if we want to test this, we just open up our chat from streamer bot here and go exclamation rec. And there it was, we've seen it, it went away. Voila, that's pretty. And additionally, you can chime this to a channel point redeem by going Twitch rewards sorry channel reward and reward redemption here we pick any um 
In this case, we create a new one. Call it get wrecked. Put whatever calls we want on here. And then, there we go. Now we have it as a channel redeem and or a command trigger. If we'd like to do another GIF, uh, the quickest, most efficient way is to right click on get wrecked and go duplicate. Here we'll change it to we suck. Go OK. And then conversely, we'd go back to here, find ourselves uh, awesome. Actually, that's not it. Let's try reset again. Now we MP3 again. Go back here. Whoops. Back it up. We suck. And we're gonna get the link for another redeem. Copy it from embed. And under the we suck action, change this sound to our new sound. Open. Okay. And then set our URL to so we suck something up. Copy it again. Paste it again. And let's see what we screwed up here. Should be right about here. Oops. And get the bleep. Yeah, and there it is. All right, so now that one's gonna work too. Save it. All right, so now that one's gonna work too. Save it. Change our man to set. Uncheck again. You can obviously change it to moderate only if you'd like. And let's pick a new reward called back. And okay. Now we've got a second gift redeem that can be done by channel point or command, depending on how your channel works. Gift pops up. Plays the sound. Gift goes away. Voila. It's really that f***ing simple. Boom. And there you have it. As you can see, you can max out your channel point redeems. Uh, Twitch lets you have up to 50 of them. So keep that in mind. Whether they're enabled or disabled, you only get 50 total. So some of the gifts you may want to just switch over to a command. Um, you can get creative and have multiple gifts in a folder. And running the command or and or redeem could just pick different ones. So it's technically only one redeem. However you want to set it up, doesn't really matter to me. I just want to get the information out there and show you just how easy it was. Make sure that if you're liking the content, you share this video with somebody. Um, I know like 80% of y'all that watch my are not subscribed. Click the button. It's free and it's easy for you and it makes me feel good about myself. And if I like had feelings, then they'd probably hurt less. I don't know. Just do it. Um, otherwise, swing on by the Discord. Come say hey, come make fun of me, or come give me a suggestion for my next video. Until next time, I'll catch you later, you f***ing maniacs.